Hello children. Today we are going to learn how to find the HCF using prime factorization method. You have already learned how to find the HCF using listing method and common division method. Let's do an example. Find the HCF of 36 and 45. To use the listing method, we have to list the factors of both the numbers. F36 is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 12, 18 and 36. F45 is equal to 1, 3, 5, 9, 15 and 45. The common factors are 1, 3 and 9. The greatest common factor is 9. Therefore, HCF is equal to 9. To use the common division method, we divide 36 and 45 by the smallest common factor of both the numbers which is 3. 36 divided by 3 is equal to 12 and 45 divided by 3 is equal to 15. Now divide 12 and 15 by the smallest common factor which is again 3. 12 divided by 3 is equal to 4 and 15 divided by 3 is equal to 5. Since 4 and 5 do not have any common factors, we cannot divide further and the HCF will be the product of the common factors 3 and 3. Therefore, HCF is equal to 3 into 3 which is equal to 9. Now, you will learn one more method to find the HCF which is called the prime factorization method. You already know the meaning of prime factorization. It is finding the prime factors of a number. In this method, first prime factorize each of the given numbers using short division method. Then express each number as a product of all the prime factors. After that, circle all the common factors. And in the end, multiply the common factors to get the HCF. Now, let's do an example. Use the prime factorization method to find the HCF of 36 and 45. The first step is to prime factorize both the numbers. Let's begin with 36. 36 is an even number. So, the smallest prime number 2 is a factor of 36. Divide 36 by 2 is equal to 18. Again, 2 is a factor of 18. 18 divided by 2 is equal to 9. 2 is not a factor of 9, so we jump to the next prime number, 3. 3 is a factor of 9. 9 divided by 3 is equal to 3. And 3 divided by 3 is equal to 1. Next, prime factor is 45. 45 is an odd number, so the smallest prime number 2 is not a factor of 45. The next prime number is 3 which is a factor of 45. 45 divided by 3 is equal to 15. 3 is again a factor of 15. 15 divided by 3 is equal to 5. The factor of 5 is the prime number 5. 5 divided by 5 is equal to 1. We have finished the first step, prime factorization of both the numbers. The next step is to express the numbers as a product of all their prime factors. Remember, every composite number can be expressed as a product of all its prime factors. So, 36 is a product of its prime factors 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 and 45 is a product of its prime factors 3 into 3 into 5. Before we continue to the next step, which is circling the common factors, there is an important fact for you to understand. You have learned that when we prime factorize a number to get its prime factors, we do not include 1 because 1 is not a prime number. But here, the purpose of prime factorization is not to get the prime factors. It is to get the highest common factor of the numbers. And when we say only factor, 1 is also included. So now, 36 is equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 into 1. 
and 45 is equal to 3 into 3 into 5 into 1. The common factors are 3, 3 and 1. Therefore, HCF is equal to the product of these common factors 3 into 3 into 1 which is equal to 9. Before we end, let's do one more example. Find the HCF of 96, 112 and 108 using prime factorization method. As you did in the previous example, you have to prime factorize all the three numbers. Let's begin with 96. 96 divided by 2 is equal to 48. 48 by 2 is equal to 24. 24 by 2 is equal to 12. 12 by 2 is equal to 6. 6 by 2 is equal to 3. And 3 is divisible by 3. So 3 by 3 is equal to 1. The next number is 112. 112 divided by 2 is equal to 56. 56 divided by 2 is equal to 28. 28 divided by 2 is equal to 14. 14 divided by 2 is equal to 7. And the smallest prime factor of 7 is 7. So 7 divided by 7 is equal to 1. The last number is 108. 108 divided by 2 is equal to 54. 54 divided by 2 is equal to 27. The smallest prime factor of 27 is 3. So 27 divided by 3 is equal to 9. 9 will also be divided by 3 is equal to 3. And 3 divided by 3 is equal to 1. The next step is express all the three numbers as a product of their prime factors as well as 1. 96 is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 1. 112 is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 7 into 1. And 108 is equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 into 3 into 1. Now circle all the common factors which are 2. 2 and 1. Therefore, HCF is equal to the product of these common factors 2 into 2 into 1 which is equal to 4. Mm -hmm.